So I like this girl, and I want to get to know her. But I don't want to stalk her. I want to get to know everything about her without sifting through page by page. This is how you do it. Nicole Scott here for Netbook News, and here we have a nice little treat for you. This is a smart, smart Q10 uh, tablet. This is also a very cheap tablet from China. You can see at the bottom we see some exposed screws, but hey, it drops the price, so why not? You can see it has an accelerometer with the, uh, the screen switching like that. Uh, around the front we have a back, home, and menu button. So this is running Android 2.2. Um, let's pull up the settings. Check it out. Yeah, so running 2.2, and it is actually running uh, a, a, car, a ARM A9 processor, and this is also has Mali 400. So, if we select, say, the video player, see if there's anything in here. Oh, actually, why don't we go to the gallery? Oops. Oops. Mm. I mean, for. This is actually a rock chip tablet, or a, uh, a rock chip version of the A9, which is a very cheap, cheap processor from China. Actually, this is capacitive. Let's see if we can play some video. No, nope, no video loaded. <laughs> So let's take a look around this tablet. This, this should be coming in at around $200 because of the exposed screws and the cheapness of the processor. Um, around the side we have the audio jacks. There's a mi micro, mini USB speaker. Uh, that's a micro SD card there at the top. More speakers around the side. There's the PSU and the power button. There's the, ex uh, the screen to stop the accelerometer. And I believe these are volume rocker. Right, so actually, surprisingly, this, this tablet, you know, is kind of iPhone-esque in its kind of uh, rounded form, a little bit cheaper, but I'm actually incredibly surprised that the only inputs on this are a micro mini USB and a micro SD card. So that's actually very interesting. So the price point on this will probably be around 2 to 220 at least. So this is actually a pretty interesting 10 inch tablet because it's running Molly 400, which will give you Tegra like graphics performance on your tablet. So Nicole Scott for Netflix News down here at the Arm Media Suite in the Grand Hyatt at Computex 2011.